This is part of the Kikuyu Reserve, the chief trouble centre in Kenya, where for many months the Mau Mau have held loyal Africans in a grip of terror. To Fort Hall, a lonely outpost in the heart of the reserve, comes Major General Hind, the director of operations against the terrorists, to inspect the men whose job it is to track down the murderers and bring them to justice. Kikuyu hutments have been taken over as command posts, and in one of these, Major General Hind checks up his campaign tactics with local officers. These outposts are in perpetual danger from the Mau Mau, who creep in from the countryside to attack the loyal villagers. General Hind surveys the vast area where terrorists are known to be in hiding, while overhead an aircraft keeps up the search. In the rough forest land below, the Mau Mau wait until nightfall. Kikuyu Home Guard, who are doing magnificent work, greet the general as he continues his tour. The fact that the Mau Mau draws many members from the Kikuyu itself tends to thrust into the background the firm loyalty of the vast majority of these men. At Achichi, deep in the danger area, they build stockades against the terrorists who have vowed to kill all who assist the white man. In talks with leading tribesmen, through an interpreter, General Hind pays tribute to their efforts to cleanse their country from the evil. The Kukuyu, with the full support of British forces, are now using methods proved successful in Malaya. Meanwhile, the situation is still grave, and the Secretary of State for the Colonies, Mr. Oliver Littleton, flies in to Nairobi. Sir Evelyn Baring, the Governor, and Nairobi's Mayor wait to greet him. Mr. Littleton will spend a week in Kenya discussing the emergency with the men at the top to prepare a report on the Mau Mau for submission to Her Majesty's government. <laughs> 